Well, off to a cloudy start this morning around western Washington. Not a big surprise there. We had our showers around uh, yesterday afternoon, but also some sunshine out there, so not a bad day, though we only hit 52 degrees out at SeaTac, so kind of a chilly day. Normal high is 62. Take a look at the Doppler radar this morning, looking very familiar. We have a few showers around, nothing too severe. Most of the showers out towards the coast in southwestern Washington. We have a uh, convergence zone going on this morning. You can see producing some showers up there, primarily around parts of the northern Kitsap and northeastern Olympic Peninsula, and then spreading out over uh, Whidbey Island, Camino Islands, and on up there towards oh, towards Arlington and Mount Vernon. That's we're going to see most of the showers this morning. Then after that, we get the heating by that spring sunshine in this afternoon. We'll pop up a few scattered showers around the area as we head into this afternoon. Take a look at the Everett Tower. Cam looking pretty quiet. You can see the city lights reflected back in the low clouds there. And checking the waterfront camera, seeing a uh, very quiet morning going on there. Uh, just cloudy skies around, and most, most places are going to have a dry commute today. So that's definitely good news there. Down in Olympia, which is uh, one of our frequent wet places also looking dry starting off the day. Checking temperatures from our school net sites, uh, quite a bit of a range around. It is a cool air mass sitting over us. In fact, Shelton down to 32 degrees this morning. Definitely our coolest spot around and see some 30s down there. Olympia South, we're 35 at one of our Olympia stations, 39 in Chehalis, and then towards the Strait of Juan de Fuca, 37 in Port Angeles and 39 degrees in Clallam Bay. Take a look at the satellite image, a little weak system moving primarily through Oregon, kind of passing through, just giving us some clouds with that. A little bit of high pressure moving through as we head towards this afternoon. This next system you see out here is headed primarily towards Oregon. It's just going to brush by us as we head towards later Thursday. And at this point, it looks like tomorrow will be mostly a dry day, just a stray shower during the daytime. And then at Friday, it's going to be dry, it looks like. And then as we head on towards uh, Friday night, still looks like we're going to see that storm system moving in Friday night, which is going to wet things down at least to start Saturday. But then showers will decrease during the day. And right now, Sunday's not looking like a bad day. In fact, uh, we might push up close to 60 degrees on Sunday. So something to look forward to. Take a look at uh, the forecast. If you're headed up towards the mountains today, well, there's a computer model. Forgot about that. That's just showing a few showers around today, and that's especially as we head towards the afternoon, we get that little bit of spring heating. Things should kind of die off overnight tonight. Tomorrow, it looks like we just see fewer showers. Those will be mostly in the afternoon, it looks like. And then as we head towards Friday, we're going to be looking for that system to kind of move in here and begin to soak us down. But you can see most of the shower action tomorrow takes place as you head towards late afternoon and early evening. Check in the forecast. We're headed towards the mountains today. No problems up there. They've got uh, cloudy skies this morning. They'll have a few showers. Snow levels between about three and 4,000 feet, but basically dealing with dry pavement if you're heading over the mountains. And afternoon past temperatures, upper 30s and low 40s. If you're headed out towards the coast today, we're going to be looking for partly sunny skies, just a few afternoon showers, upper 40s to low 50s. And down the east slopes of the Cascades, clouds this morning, but then uh, partly to mostly sunny skies. There is a frost warning up. I believe at this time of the year, mainly from about Wenatchee northward this morning. And uh, we'll look forward to warm up, though, with highs in the mid-50s uh, to the low 60s. Around Puget Sound, we're going to be looking for partly sunny skies. There's a few showers around, mainly convergence zone this morning, just kind of scattered around this afternoon. Mid-50s for the highs. A few afternoon showers Thursday. Dry during the day Friday, but rain moves in Friday night, turns to showers Saturday. Dry during the day Sunday, another round of rain Sunday night. Starting off the work week with showers and sun breaks.